I think what stood out about Denijah to me was her willingness to open up to me and um, her personality really stood out. Every session she opened up more and more and I found myself going, wow, you do that too? Wow, you do that too? <laughs> So despite her problems that she felt she had with communicating and with being open with others, her long resume of activities and her volunteer hours, it all painted a different story. So uh, once she began to practice more, I could tell that she was more comfortable. The more meetings we had, I could tell she was more comfortable with me and she was more comfortable with the other members. So I think just having more experiences with us and being able to share her story gave her more confidence. She spoke to me about being on student council and various things at school. And I was just so, so proud of her. And I said, well, you know, you just have to keep pushing yourself to open up in more areas. I can tell that you're comfortable and you're vocal at school. So let's just continue to grow in those areas. My name is Denijah Jones, I am 17. I go to Normandy High School and I'm a senior. What makes me me is that I'm very independent, I'm open-minded, I'm motivated. I am a member of Be Great and I've been a member since freshman year. My experience with Boys and Girls Club was hard at first, but it gradually got easy. It gave me a lot of opportunities and helped me be here today. In the program, we did a lot of community service. I like doing community service. I like doing projects for the community. And I like being involved in the community. My post-graduation plan is to continue going to the firefighter program and to also work and get ready to go to college. My great future looks like to brand my business. My business is a cosmetic line. I started it when I was 15. I wanted to expand more. I want to get more orders to different countries and different states. My personal quote is, in every storm, there's always a rainbow at the end. Good evening, everyone. I'm glad I'm able to stand here and speak in front of you guys today. I say that in the way because before being a part of Boys and Girls Club, I had a hard time speaking in front of people and also being in front of big crowds. My freshman year was the hardest year of high school, it, yet it was my first year. And it was challenging because I didn't know how to have conversations and how to start conversations or how to meet new people. When I started to participate in Boys and Girls Club, it offered me a lot of opportunities to overcome the fear that I had when it comes down to speaking to new people, getting to learn new people, and to see new things. During my sophomore year, I had a half of a sophomore year because we had went onto a global pandemic. I started to feel like I was gonna be such a loner and I wasn't gonna have the experience that everyone else had when it came down to being able to make new friends and being able to seek new things in life. When I met my mentor, Ms. Julia, she helped me and she showed me different ways I can overcome my fear. She also introduced smart girls to me to where when I was after school, I would stay after and participate or at least try to when it came down. Yet again, I was with a lot of females, so that was kind of challenging because that wasn't on my type of level. During my junior year, I w we were still in a pandemic to where we was virtual online to where I felt like I was back how I was in the ending of eighth grade freshman year to where I thought I would never be able to actually speak and actually get out of my anxiety and being nauseous and nervous around talking to other people. Ms. Julia emailed me and gave me suggestions on how I can make things work throughout the pandemic. Afterwards, I started to take her advice and start moving on with life and started to challenge myself to the things that I thought I wouldn't be able to succeed in or I thought I was gonna fail in. Now I am currently a senior in high school and I can honestly say my progress from freshman year until my senior year has been tough, but yet worth it. 
And if it wasn't for Miss Julia or any of the Boys and Girls Club staff that helped me overcome what I was afraid of or overcome the challenges and always told me that I got it and encouraged me and motivated me to keep on and keep pushing, I would not be standing in front of you guys today. Thank you.